Okay, we are here at Everglade Seasoning and we are gonna cook some lunch today and I brought in a couple little guest chefs to help me and I'm gonna let them introduce themselves. My name is Caitlin Johnson. My name is Baylor Johnson. And where are you guys from? Mayo, Florida. And who are you visiting? Our favorite Aunt Kelly. <laughs> Alright, what are you gonna put in this mac and cheese that you're making for us today? Um, cheese, butter, milk, mm -hmm. noodles, sour cream, and flour. Is that it? Um, we have a secret ingredient. Um, we sprinkle it on like pixie dust. Like pixie dust? And it's magic. <laughs> We're gonna get everything ready and get started, and we'll be right back. Our noodles are boiling, and those are almost done. All right. Okay, so we are going to turn this on, and the first thing we're going to do what is melt some we're butter. We're going to melt. So I'm going to give this to some you. Some butter. Okay. Okay. All right. So we're just going to melt that butter, and when we get it good and melty, I think it's going to take a few minutes for that. You're good. So what do you think you like better, mac and cheese or the chicken tenders? Chicken tenders. I'll like the chicken tenders, probably. Um, since well, I ever tasted the since, seasoning. Since, since I'm probably going to do this, I probably like both. Both? Okay. Don't hit what your do you, hand on the pot. What do you eat a lot at home? What, what do you eat a lot at home? Mm. Uh, um, do no. <laughs> we sometimes do that. Yeah, we sometimes. But, sometimes but Mama always likes to eat um, salmon salad, so sometimes we have to eat that always. Sometimes you have to eat that always? I like salmon salad, but we have to eat it all the time. All the time because Mama likes it? Yes, yeah, she loves it. She's like picking it every dinner she wants. <laughs> so. Not... Well, Mama, get off the salmon salad a little bit and make something else. Yeah. Well, what else? Hey, 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 like, hey, what hey. is? Coco makes it, and uh -huh. Mama tells her what to make. Okay. And always salmon salad. It's pretty good. Actually. Well, if you guys were to make, you said something of like about a Southwest chicken Southwest casserole. Southwest chicken casserole. That sounds good. What's in I, that? I think it's got cream chicken, uh -huh. and it's got. Does it have like black beans in it? No. No. You can add black beans. You can add tomatoes or whatever. What makes it Southwest? There's melted cheese mm -hmm. and um. That sounds good. Bailey. You guys, Bailey. Do you guys Bailey. eat a lot of veggies in your house? I eat a lot. Bailey, you we have veggies, again. but some of the kids don't. Mm -hmm. No. It's yes. melting. Okay, we're good. Yes. So what we're gonna do probably is take your spatula away from you, and I'm gonna let Baylor. Add the flour, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna whisk it in, okay? And I'm gonna okay. hand you a whisk. And what you do is you take it and you lightly. I know. Okay, you know. I know how to use the whisk. Okay. Right. So he's gonna. You good? Yeah. Okay. I just. Take he's gonna add the flour in there for you, okay? Little bits, and then let her. Next tip. All right. What's next on our list? All right, after the flour, we have uh, two whole cups of milk. Okay, and do we add that as she's whisking that into the butter? Um, I okay. guess Okay, so. I'm gonna do this one. Okay, keep stirring, stir gentle. Okay. Gentle. All right. Whoa. Keep whisking. Keep whisking. Whisking is a fun word, isn't it? Yeah. You gotta get all that flour blended up. Cause this is gonna be like part of our cheese. See all the hey, it looks all, it looks like eggs. Egg yolk. Yeah. Hey, whoa, gently now. Hey, get Baylor, the I, know how to, I know how to cook. It's not like I ever know how to cook. Mm -hmm. I cooked before. Yep. Oh. You have to. So, all right, so, guys. Where's the pixie dust? <gasps> where's the pixie dust? Here it is. No, here it is. Here that is. To, we're gonna sprinkle this in as you're whisking. I think we need to do it a little bit faster though, okay? okay See how let it's me getting do it. okay, but it's getting clumpy over there, so I'm gonna sprinkle that, maybe turn this down a little bit. Okay. Can I help it just a tiny tiny bit? Mm-hmm. Okay. Help me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. 
Okay, we're back. We had to we had to make a little tiny correction, huh? It's it's looking better now, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Well, what happened is Hot bed. Hot bed. we failed to double the recipe because we're making it double, so it was getting a little lumpy, wasn't it? We didn't have enough milk in it. Yeah. And now it's getting nice and creamy, right? Yes. We had to fix it fast. But we yes. got it. What do we have next? A whole container of sour cream. Okay. We're gonna do one container of sour cream. But I'm going to put a whole container, and I'm going to put this in, and you're going to stir it in with your whisk. Move that away for just a second, very gently, okay? Okay. And you're just going to stir it in with all your milk and flour mixture, okay? Just going to try to keep it creamy. <clears throat> I think, do you think this mac and cheese is going to be so good? Have you ever made mac and cheese like this before? No. Do you I make don't. Velveeta mac and cheese? No. Kraft mac and cheese? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. You just need to do a bit more. All right. Now stir that around. Stir. It. You gotta get it hard. I know that. Okay. I'm doing. I'm just checking it over here. We got. Okay. So we got the Everglades already in there. Two. We're gonna. This is gonna be so good. Twenty ounces of cheddar cheese. Let's just put in cheese until it looks good. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna because need. My um, friend Jenna has taught me that you them. don't yeah. always have to measure. Can I put it in? She laughs at me because I measure everything to like the tippy top of the cup. And I said, what are you doing one day? And she said, I'm just throwing it in. We're just gonna, we're just gonna start adding some cheese in like handful by handful and let her just stir it around, okay? Keep stirring, Copeland. That's very nice how you're sprinkling that in there. Very decorative. Very gentle. Very gentle. Have you ever thought about being like a, are you gonna be one of those dads when you grow up that cooks for the family? Yeah. Hmm? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I am. I like to cook. Does your, fun. does your dad cook much? No. Well, hamburgers. Hamburgers? Like, is he a griller? Does he like to yeah. grill stuff? Yeah, he likes to grill stuff. Right. Yes, well, he does. Courtney grills. No, Daddy grills sometimes once he's off of work. Okay, well. Yeah, sometimes. What does your dad do? But Coco, once Daddy's on work, she does. She does the grilling. Yes. So, um, what does okay, your dad enough. do? What does he do for work? He works for the city in Taylor County. But what does he do? Police department. And what does he have? Canine unit. He's got a canine unit. You don't know what my dad does? Yes, I know what your daddy does. We're just introducing him to everyone else via uh, you guys. Okay. Nobody else knows what he does other than grill when he's off work, obviously. You think it's getting good? Yeah. Good and cheesy? Yeah. Okay, because eventually we're going to have to pour it over top of those noodles we just boiled. And then we're going to pop that in the oven and bake it, okay? And then we're going to move on to the chicken. Is that good? I we got think it's our good. mac and cheese. Um, uh, cheese sauce poured on the mac and cheese, and uh, we added a little bit of um, shredded cheese on top, and we'll pop it in the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes. We're gonna yeah. assembly line this. We're gonna tell everybody what we did. So you put the flour and the Hidden and Valley Ranch dips in dips here and stirred that all up, Mix right? Them all up. Then what we did is we put the shredded cheese and what else? The panko breadcrumbs and the bacon bits in that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take one of these and dip it in the flour mixture, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And then we're going to stick it in this yummy, yummy egg mixture Ooh. and then open your bag up, okay? Okay, here it comes. And then you're gonna sh put that tight, seal it up tight, and then shake it, okay? Now shake it and get all that stuff covered all over the chicken. I think it's good. We're gonna do that with all the rest of them, okay? And then right. we'll come back and show them what it looks like, okay. okay? Okay. You guys are doing so good. I think everybody at home is gonna be so inspired by this. Don't you think? Yeah. That they're gonna wanna make this tonight? Oh yeah. I think we got everything coated and on our baking sheet. So now we're gonna sprinkle a little bit of that fish and chicken magic on top of it. 
before Make we... it taste good. Make it taste good before we pop it in the oven. Yep. Is it coming out? Yeah, it's coming. Okay. It's coming. It is. That's And then we're going to put it in the oven at what, 400 degrees? 400 degrees. Okay. And how long did it say to cook them? Uh, I don't know what it was. Right there, right there, and right there, and right there, and right there, and right there. And right there. And right there. Hi, we're back. Okay. So we got all this yummy looking food out of the oven and we're going to dish it up and then you guys are going to taste test it for us, okay? All right? And then let us know what your favorite is, how it tastes, what your favorite part of today was in cooking. What was your favorite part? Uh, my favorite part was me mixing. You mixing? The yeah. whisking? Yeah. Yeah, that was a good part. All right, it's gonna be hot for just a second, okay? Blow on it, I'm gonna give you a knife. Okay, so it's delicious? Yes. Mm -hmm. The chicken's juicy. Juicy? Is this something you think you could go back and yes. cook for everybody at home? You think you could handle that? Yeah, I'll try to remember yeah. the rest. So yeah, what does, it taste, what does it taste like? Chicken? Chicken, does it taste like magic? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm, the seasoning's good. I, like I think you guys did a great job. Thank you. Thank you for coming in here and cooking with us today. Thank you. You're welcome. Tell everybody what you think about Everglades seasoning. It's good. Try it's it. good. <laughs> it's the best? It's magic. I eat it. I eat it. Uh -huh. well, I love you guys. You did, I love an awesome, you too. did an awesome job. Mm -hmm. I'm eating here. Come back again. Say bye. Bye bye. bye. bye.